Gestation, Wikipedia Audio Gestation is the carrying of an embryo or fetus inside female viviparous animals. It is typical for mammals, but also occurs for some non-mammals. Mammals during pregnancy can have one or more gestations at the same time. The time interval of a gestation is called the gestation period. In human obstetrics, gestational age refers to the embryonic or fetal age plus two weeks. This is approximately the duration since the woman's last menstrual period began. In mammals, pregnancy begins when a zygote implants in the female's uterus and ends once the fetus leaves the uterus. Mammals On the main article link above, are average and approximate gestation values ordered by number of days. Human pregnancy can be divided roughly into three trimesters, each approximately three months long. The first trimester is from the last period to the 13th week, the second trimester is from the 14th to 27th week, and the third trimester is from the 28th week to the 42nd week. In humans, birth normally occurs at a gestational age of about 40 weeks, though it is common for births to occur from 37 to 42 weeks. After 8 weeks, the embryo is called a fetus. A viviparous animal is an animal employing vivipari, the embryo develops inside the body of the mother, as opposed to outside in an egg. The mother then gives live birth. The less developed form of vivipari is called ovoviviparity, which, for instance, occurs in most vipers. The more developed form of vivipari is called placental viviparity, mammals are the best example, but it has also evolved independently in other animals, such as in scorpions, some sharks, and in velvet worms. Viviparous offspring live independently and require an external food supply from birth. Certain lizards also employ this method such as the genera Tiliqua and Coracea. The placenta is attached directly to the mother in these lizards which is called viviparous matrotrophy. Ovoviviparous animals develop within eggs that remain within the mother's body up until they hatch or are about to hatch. This strategy of birth is known as ovoviviparity. It is similar to vivipari in that the embryo develops within the mother's body. Unlike the embryos of viviparous species, ovoviviparous embryos are nourished by the egg yolk rather than by the mother's body. However, the mother's body does provide gas exchange. Ovoviviparity is the method of reproduction used by many aquatic life forms such as fish and some sharks, reptiles, and invertebrates. The young of ovoviviparous amphibians are sometimes born as larvae, and undergo metamorphosis outside the body of the mother. The Singnathidae family of fish has the unique characteristic whereby females lay their eggs in a brood pouch on the male's chest and the male incubates the eggs. Fertilization may take place in the pouch or before implantation in the water. Included in Singnathidae are seahorses, the pipefish, and the weedy and leafy sea dragons. Singnathidae is the only family in the animal kingdom to which the term male pregnancy has been applied. Humans Non-mammals